A record number of abortions took place in England and Wales last year. That is this week's Speak Out segment. New statistics reveal there were nearly 211,000 abortions in England and Wales in 2020. That is the highest number there since the Abortion Act of 1967 was introduced. When you take a close look at the numbers, you'll see disturbing trends. Abortion pills through the mail became the most common abortion procedure. Telemedicine abortion accounted for 47% of abortions in England and Wales between April to December 2020. 3,083 abortions took place because of an unborn baby's disability diagnosis. The UK government is currently deciding whether or not to make abortion pills through the mail permanent post-pandemic. During what was a record high year of abortions in England and Wales, the most common procedure entailed mothers taking abortion pills, which they got through the mail at home alone to end the life of their own child. We need to mourn that. 2020 was a year of so much tragedy and death and loss of life. And now we know that tragic year of loss also entailed the tragic loss of so many unborn babies. The abortion industry would like you to think abortion pills are harmless, easy enough you can get them through the mail and take without supervision. But you need to know abortion pills cause severe cramping, contractions, and heavy bleeding to force an unborn baby out. It is dangerous for a woman to be home alone as this happens. You also need to know that abortion pill reversal is possible after a woman takes the first of two pills. As abortion pills become a more common procedure, we need to spread the word about the reality of abortion pill reversal. In the face of a record year for abortion in England and Wales, let us pray that God transforms the culture so we can soon celebrate a record year of life going forward.